factor in this game will be Glenn Robinson the third because he's the one who's really going to have to get into the teeth of that two three zone. To beat that two three zone, you need somebody who can make plays at the foul line extended. To me, that's GR three. Are there any sons of big stars left in this? Yeah, uh, who, those two. Uh, yeah, who, uh, Hardaway and Glenn Hardaway, Robinson. Right. Hardaway, the third, yeah. yeah. Now, do you think uh, Tim Hardaway Jr. hates gay guys like his father does? <laughs> Interesting premise. You know, I mean, I'm sure we'll get to that between now and Monday night. <laughs> Good answer, John. I mean, we, honestly, you know, people are sweeping that under the rug. One of the most blatant anti-gay things ever said. I mean, to where you, he couldn't have been misquoted. You could ah, that I hear you wrong, Bob. Tim Hardaway, uh, Tim Hardaway. Jr.'s father, when he was playing for the Golden State Warriors, I think, mm -hmm. said, uh, I hate gay people. <laughs> I mean, it's not amazing. even like, a, I don't like gay people, I hate gay people. Like, uh, uh, as blatant and as honest as you could be. Amazing. Yeah, so uh, I, I guess uh, I guess people forgot about that. Where's Tim Hardaway Sr. now? Does he go to the game? Oh, he goes to every game. Yeah, and, and his kid is, is spectacular. He's very supportive. What? He's very supportive. He even said after... Uh, his son made a three in one of the games against the like tournament. He said to the person next to him, I got skills. <laughs> right. Well, listen, uh, he's got skills, absolutely. Hey, this is this is their, their best run. First five. Uh, so your your prediction would be Michigan? No, I mean, I said Louisville over Syracuse. I just wouldn't be shocked if Michigan won a couple of games. You think Bernie Fine is innocent? <laughs> <laughs> what did they say? I plead the fifth? <laughs> <laughs> All right, fine. Listen, I don't know. I think some something, something might have went on. There. John is rarely speechless, Artie, and you've been able to twice in this. Well, interview. no, I'm just saying that th these are th there are some uh, controversial things that surround college hoops. One of them sure. is Bernie Fine's situation. Uh, you know, uh, I don't know. Did he did he ever molest a kid? I think the number of kids Bernie Fine has molested is somewhere in between the amount Jerry Sandusky has molested and Brent molested. <laughs> and so that would be zero and 82. Brent, is Emily in the studio? <laughs> she is. She is. Nice, John. Way I said to bail me out. zero and 82. So <laughs> no, zero no, you're would be right. Brent. I appreciate that. 82 being That's Sandusky. praise. <laughs> yeah, she is here tonight. And She's she, uh... gorgeous. How hot is she, John? <laughs> John doesn't like blondes. She doesn't like her. Yeah, I don't, I don't like blondes. Well, it sounds like Tim Hardaway doesn't like you. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? What's not the? She's angelic looking. Well, come on. I mean, you make an exception for this blonde. Yeah, no, I know. I mean, it's Brent's girl, though. I can't even talk no, about that. I, I know, but I mean, we can all admire her and, and gawk over and, uh, you know, <laughs> pledge ourselves to her in private. What? Uh, no, yeah. I mean, you know, we say blonde. She doesn't look like Tom Petty. I mean, let's face it. Good looking girl. Yeah, I 